Because everybody kind of goes through it, right? I mean, Jordan mm -hmm. Spieth was supposed to be the guy. Boom. Rory was supposed to be the yeah. guy. Boom. It was good to see him back, by the way. Yeah, yeah. Good to see Rory well. back. Yeah. It has been great to see that. But all these guys were supposed to be the guys, and then they kind of fall off. Feels like Brooks was supposed to be one of those. And then we watch that doc on him. It's like, this guy feels like he's what, – what is it? You just got to work through it? Do some guys never get – Well, yeah, I mean, he, he, he worked through it for sure. But it's so hard these days, you know, to be at the top uh, in golf. The strength and depth – um, in the fields, you know, it's just phenomenal. You know, pretty much everyone that tees it up can win. Hell, we saw a club pro yesterday, Michael Block, uh, you know, playing so well. Um, it's, uh, but the, the strength and the, and the depth of the fields, you know, there are so many new youngsters coming out. Victor Hovland is only 25. He is going to have a hell of a career. Um, you know, I, but I think that's got a lot to do with it. It's, it's, it's hard to stay, you know, Tiger Woods was at the top of 631 weeks. Greg Norman was like 330 weeks. Um, you know, we're not going to see that again. I, I don't think, you know, because of that sort of talent that's been percolating up to the, the top. Percolating. That's a good song there. <laughs> Scotty Scheffler's been phenomenal to watch. <laughs> yeah. He started dancing a little bit yesterday. That was good to see. He had a bad Saturday by his standards mm -hmm. and was one of the only seven people under par still. Like, mm -hmm. he is phenomenal. Yeah. Right? Bland. Bland. Oh, yeah, very bland. Bl he is bland white golfing. Mm -hmm. I mean, if you've ever seen it. <laughs> but his talent is so entertaining to watch. Yeah. He's doing stuff that... You know, just on such a consistent basis, you don't expect. And then you think about Michael Block just Damn. coming into the fucking program this weekend. Yeah. Tone has a question yeah. for you since you brought him up. That was the story of the weekend, I believe. Yeah, David. So I believe it was Friday. He was, I can't remember what hole it was. It was a par three, though. And, and he was playing well at this point. And then he just shanked one straight right. And I thought, like, any normal person or a normal average golfer, not a professional golfer, obviously, that's all they think about the rest of the round and the next three <laughs> months that they're playing golf. How does yeah. like in the professional world, like if that happens, if a shake like that happens, like how how does that play in your guys' mind, and how impressive is it that like he was able to overcome that? Yeah, you know, it's uh, they say it's the closest thing to a perfect shot, which is uh, garbage. <laughs> it's not. Uh, but we, we saw Dustin Johnson hit a shank um, on the uh, on the seventh hole last week in Tulsa. Uh, in our live event, I mean, a clean pipe, it just went, you know, 60 yards right. And he came back and birdied the next two holes. You know, so th these guys are so mentally tough. And, uh, <clears throat> you know, it's, it's, it's easy for us not to hit a shank. Let's put it that way. You know, you make sure you hit it a little, little closer to the toe. And we're talking millimeters at this level of the game. You know, uh, with this, the sweet spot in a golf club is real small. But, uh, you know, they can move it around. <coughs> Excuse me. All right, it's okay. Happy to hear you're all right. I was battling a little allergies last week. Yeah, you were, yeah. Oh, I'm yeah. taking Claritin in the morning, Allegra at night. I mean, it is. Ooh. I'm trying to get all sides <laughs> of this thing taken care of. All good. Don't you worry about coughing ever with us. We appreciate you having your conversation <laughs> with us. Let's, let's expand, though, on Michael Block. Because I feel like whenever I go to these courses that have a course pro, a PGA pro, they're on the driving range. And if they're hitting the ball, it's – phenomenal to watch i mean it's like they're yeah. hitting everything out there and i always ask like hey why aren't you in like the why aren't you just winning the and they talk about oh no it's a different level pros are a different level pros are a different level yeah. michael block i guess has played in some tournaments he said that in one of his interviews mm -hmm. while he's walking down uh the fairway he said he doesn't do as many instructional things anymore because he's been lucky enough to win some golf tournaments so he doesn't have to grind for 90 minutes 150 bucks telling people come out of the pocket mm -hmm. come out of the pocket mm -hmm. and hit that thing solid mm -hmm. what do you think is different about him and he's got invited to next week's tournament as well do you think he has, he staying, has. do you think he has staying power with how he plays um it, it's really tough you know for a club pro to come out here even if you don't teach much even if you do play a lot uh, you know, the, the standard is so incredibly high on, on these professional tours. Um, you know, Michael might play well this week at Colonial in Fort Worth. Um, you know, I, I, it's an interesting story, no matter what way you look at it. Um, but it's, it's very tough to play, uh, to play at that level one week in a row, never mind two. Yeah, I'm excited to see, like... What if he plays good? That'd be, That'd so be awesome. sweet. Huh? Because he had it, yeah. too. He had yeah. the moxie. Yeah. Another yeah. hole in one. You know, on 18, with the uh, three wood yeah. that he had been shaping, he goes, 
in the pe middle of the people. So perfect for the story. And allegedly, they were filming the whole thing. Mm -hmm. Allegedly, they're oh, filming the behind the sweet. scenes, the whole thing. Him having a hole in one, that's going to be a fantastic part of the story. Yeah. But him hitting that shank on 18, then having to make the putt after the flop to stay yeah. in top 15, knowing that that means he's in next year's tournament, which is a massive deal if you watched him really operate good. at all. That's a huge deal for him. So him stepping over there and making, what if Michael Block's fucking got it? Let's do he it. Might? You know what I mean, Ty? Yeah. What if this guy's got it and he just didn't know? He just needed the situation yeah. to pop up in his life for him to prove it. What if Michael Block's a guy? <laughs> Crazier things have happened. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You know, it is. You know, stranger things have happened. You know, we've seen it more often on the Champions Tour and the Senior Tour where a guy's been a club pro his whole life and comes out all of a sudden, you know, find something, you know, to see it on the P uh, on the PJ tour, you know, w would be, uh, well, I mean, that will be different. For sure. Impossible. That's you're a saying. Big leap. Sounds like you're saying yeah. impossible. Yeah. 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 yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> hey, that champions tour, <laughs> champions tour, any chance of like somebody that never played professionally and at the age of 36 still can't really make a putt or do many right. good things around a green. You think there's a chance of the champions tour being a level that that particular person who I am just making up, fake human. That random. Fake human. Do you think there's a chance that person could get on the Champions Tour at any point? Champions Tour at any point? Not a, not a snowball's chance in hell. 20 years? 20 years? <laughs> really? 20 well, years? That guy's got a lot. 20 years. Better start playing. Better start yeah, playing. Yeah. Yeah, 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 you better start. Better start practicing now, that's for sure. But, the, you know, these guys have played their whole lives. Most of them, you know, I mean, you're talking about Iron Man, you know, like Langer. You know, it's he's just, uh, you know, I mean, he, he's a freak of nature. All right. Well, that guy's going to make it. Yeah, there's still a chance. <laughs> that guy's going to make it. And uh, I can't wait to see it happen. Just like I can't thank you enough for joining us, sir.